Hey, this is Doug from Doug and Nikki here in our outdoor testing studio, otherwise known as our RV, where last year I updated the TV and this year I'm updating the sound system because if we're on vacation and relaxing, I need to annoy Nikki with full, full sounding action adventure movies because every wife loves that when they're on vacation. So let's set, let's unbox this. We'll set it up. I'll talk to you about its features and then at the end, after we see how it works, I'll give you a Doug score from one to five and let you know. So this is one of these cool sound bars that actually comes as two pieces, which I think is perfect for me because I'm not actually going to use it as a bar under the TV. I'm going to use it as two separate speakers on either side of the TV. It is 50 watts, which is pretty darn impressive for a sound bar. Let's see. These are the bases here. And we got the two bases. They're nice. You can see it's pre-wired to connect the two bases. You don't have to attach any wires. And speaking of wires, it comes with a USB wire, a regular aux cable, a clicker because you have to have a clicker, which is awesome. the 3.5 millimeter connection. So if you're gonna run it off like a cell phone or something like that. This is a mount for the wall if you wanted to do it that way. Power supply. And I thought this was the most impressive. Fiber optic cable if you were gonna do an optical connection. I think this is a whole kit. Everything from wall mounting to stands to putting them together as a soundbar to optical cables is all included. You don't need anything else. Let's take a look at the speakers themselves. Okay, just by luck, I picked up the primary one first. It's cool size, 16 inches. Obviously, the two connected is going to make it 32 inches as a soundbar. Here are all the audio connections there. The other one... Okay, so this is the satellite one or the side, so this doesn't have any connections other than to mount it up or link the two together. Let's clean up this mess a little bit, get us down to what we need to test it out, right? Ready? Here it is. It's so funny, I forgot new phones don't even have those 3.5 jacks. All right, I guess we're gonna test out the uh, Bluetooth connection. Let's see if I can figure it out without getting up. Which one is the Bluetooth? Flashing blue light tends to be US Bluetooth. Let's see if it sees this device. Yeah, KY 2020. Pair. Oh, ready? And I have nice that. That really sounds good too. That is absolutely fabulous. It actually has some bass to it, which I, I wasn't really expecting. Oh, my movie's gonna sound awesome in here with this. Hold on a second. Okay. That is so ridiculously cool. I'm gonna give this a full five out of five on the Doug score, and I'm very excited about this. Not sure Nikki's gonna be quite as excited. I hope that was helpful. We'll see you next time.